I broke down, would anyone notice? Or would they fly by and look down at me? Maybe they would drive by and shoot me dead. I guess a bullet isn't as bad as the thoughts flying through my head. They might say they told me this would happen. So why are they watching me but not stopping? They say drugs will help me, but I don't want a temporary fix drag me away. If I wanted the rush of being high, I would fly right off this highway. If I stopped going through my emotions and threw myself off this guardrail, would they care or just think about how they said they knew I'd feel? If I let go of the steering wheel and climb the stairs to heaven, they'd probably steer and forget to call the cops or just park and watch until the siren stopped. Maybe I should take a break and fix my brakes or stop for gasoline, but the thing is I've stopped worrying about me. I need so much more than my tires changed, but I'm tired of all this changing. So I'll just sit stuck on the shoulder. And it really sucks and I'm sick of all these burdens on my shoulders. I broke down sitting here crying. And inside I feel like I'm lost and dying. Honestly, it seems like no one cares that the world came crashing down on me. I don't know if it's an accident or if there's a reason, but this breakdown has left me broken and bleeding. The tow truck will drive by. They might turn their heads, but they won't say bye. No one notices that I'm dying. And everybody keeps on driving. I guess they're right when they say everything changes. When I try to fix myself, my life rearranges. I'm puzzled when I try to put these pieces together. I never pictured me alone or saw my heart so severed. They say home is where the heart is. But if I'm broken hearted, does that make me homeless or heartless? Or am I just lost? Wondering where all these broken parts live Home is just a house with walls. Where would I live when everything falls? These rooms can't hold what's important in life. If they did, I'd have no hope left tonight. I guess I write poems because I just don't know what to feel or think when I'm all alone. I'm starting to live in loneliness like it's my home. Cause I like it more than watching friends come and go. They say just put on a smile and try to be happy. They're acting like happiness is all that life means. But I'm not an actor, so it's real when I bleed. And it's more than a change of temporary emotion that I want to see. I refuse to lie and just go through the motions while it's hope and truth that the whole world needs. I know they meant it when they told me they would love me forever. But the truth is, no one has ever had a perfect lover. Even though they wish they could always stay, every loved one eventually goes away. People act like it'll be all right. That's not always true. I know my broken life won't get fixed tonight. I've tried, and something I can't do. My home and hope is quickly fading. But you, you stay the same while everything changes. I 
I wish we could go back and be young again. Life was never perfect, but it seemed to be better then. If Earth could turn backwards and I could go back in time, if I could put that tape in again and try to rewind, if I could find some kind of eraser and get rid of all my mistakes, if I could only learn to love again and quit being fake. I miss playing football out in the cold, waiting for my dad, hoping that he would come. Back then, I didn't wake up afraid that something bad was going to happen to someone I love. Remember dreaming about growing up and having places of our own? That was when we didn't know that we would grow apart and end up alone. Can we go back to easy technology and VHS tapes? Back when life was as simple as those Saturdays. When we blew on Nintendo games to make them work again. Now we can't fix our problems. We're just hoping they'll end. Trying to learn how to beat another level or ride a bike. Not really worried about figuring out how to live life. I know we used to get in a mess. At least we were together when we got into trouble. Before we could send angry texts and I had a car to drive away from all my struggles. I wish we were fighting for toys instead of fighting for love. But now you're alone fighting yourself and I'm convinced that my attempts to help will never be enough. I remember after waiting my whole life, I finally became a teen. That's when I decided my parents were way too strict and controlling. A few years later, I didn't live with them anymore, and I didn't know that this loneliness was what I was wishing for. When I was a kid, I believed what I would hear. I believed that hearts could really be changed by the power of prayer. That Jesus would heal the world of its pain, now sin has become a habit and the Bible has become estranged. I remember how our parents warned us to watch out for danger. But the problem is now our own homes feel like the stranger. Back then I didn't understand divorce and broken homes and I didn't realize that death was real, not just an act like in the TV shows. Suicide was like a sad story that was just fiction when the movie would end. That was before suicide became a real danger inside my best friend's head. I wish I could go back to the time when I wished I was older. Now I miss seeing my sisters laugh together. Now those days are over. I don't see my younger bro anymore and we barely talk on the phone. My other brother died last year so I guess he's the only one who's really home. I miss and remember the good old days way back then. And I didn't realize my siblings were my best friends. Honestly, now my family and memories make me afraid. Because I'm scared that someday I'll have to bring a wife and kids into this pain. It's hard to move on when I keep looking back then. But I just hope that one day it'll be possible to love that way again. We all have so many scars, struggles, and broken story. But through it all, we can still find a way to praise God for his hope, grace, and glory. Who am I? I'm a lost boy in the woods. I would find myself a way out if I thought that I could. Alone, wandering, afraid in this darkest night. I don't got a way to rescue myself. I don't even got any light. Look within and I'm broken inside. People keep telling me to follow my heart, but that part is just a mess. It's full of death and pride. God, who am I that you would notice me? What is humanity that you would care for us? Who am I? 
Lord, only you know where I've been, what I've seen. You've seen my tears, you've seen my pain, you've seen everything. I lift this up to you, yeah. I'm broken and battered, my thoughts are all scattered, clothes are tattered, and my belonging doesn't matter. What matters is that I continue to get madder, no voice or reasoning reasons of my soulful chatter. My soul folds flatter, I'm flattered at remarks, I say don't give up, soon all the pain will be gone, poof, vanish. Like magic you're wrong No words to describe my feelings Only songs My life seems stagnant No sense of a management Imagine where I'd be if I had managed all my anger If you pardon my manners Allow me to expand them I can tell you where I've been And maybe you can understand From poverty to embarrassment Starting my comparisons Bullies bald self-esteem If I bother to return at 19 My mom vanished Tossed away like I was damaged Friends turned enemies Just to take advantage Yeah to slow down I was standing on top of that parking garage seven floors high heaven didn't seem too far if I fell forward tonight then I'd be with the stars oh lord help me now suicide's talking too loud he tell me it's fine if your head hangs with the clouds my sin is the noose perfection is the chair I try to reach on my feet but I stumble in despair I fall flat on my face knowing I'm back in this place and as bad as it tastes I pull a fast of a plate and I could in my fate proactive in my pain I'm in traumatic shape a problematic state but I'm back in this race, knowing Christ died in my place God keep track of my faith, because I cry for your grace And God, when your mercy reigns, and it's the end of my days I'll be praising your name until they see your heavenly gates, for real God, we're just broken people And God, you still love broken praise I once told stories about a man named Death, like he was a stranger that I'd one day see. Then, I was surprised by how real he is when Death came to visit my family. I once imagined heaven was so far away like it's a mystical world unknown, but when my friends went up there to stay, I remember that heaven's my home.